This is News 7 Saturday Morning with Joy Sutton and Brent Watts. Okay, well, Brent, I know you can relate to this as a parent. Yeah. Parents are always doing what they can to make sure their children are safe. That's right. Coming up on Focus on Health, we're going to tell you about a new safety program that hopes to give parents some extra guidance. Joy will have that story come out. Stay with us. children, the leading cause of death is unintentional injury. It's the reason the Red Cross started a new program in the New River Valley to give parents some guidance. And here to tell us more about the Safe Baby program is Lisa Bass, a volunteer instructor. Thank you, Lisa, for joining us this morning. As we are talking a little earlier, just you and I, we're saying how many parents, when they leave the hospital with their young infants, if something were to go wrong, many people would not know what to do. Right, and the Safe Baby program is a 60-minute course that helps teach parents what to do to prevent those injuries from occurring. But most importantly, if something does happen, how to remain calm and take emergency action steps. And that's check, call, care. Um, checking the scene to make sure you're safe to enter and checking for all the vital signs that could be life-threatening. And then calling 911 and giving that information to the dispatcher so that you can get help immediately. I thought one thing that was really different about this program is you actually go into the parents' home. You bring this program to the families. Yes, I can bring this to new parents, young parents, even grandparents who are going to have a new child in their home and look for precautions that they can take to prevent all those injuries such as poisoning, suffocations, choking, burns. And uh, we have worksheets and guides that will help them just go around the house and look for those and make sure that they're taken care of before the child comes home. I know you said this class also includes some CPR training. What kind of things that will parents learn about CPR? Will they learn how to do it on different age children or kind of what's the focus in that? We briefly review all that is offered in our CPR courses, infant child um, CPRs. Um, we just help teach them what not to do in case of an emergency, not to shake the child to check the, for consciousness, but to tap their foot. Hmm. Um, as well as if there's a choking, uh, make sure that you're not, again, shaking the baby, that you're doing the five back blows and the five chest compressions. Mm -hmm. So that's all very important to know, just to remain calm. Mm -hmm. And right now the program is just offered in the Roanoke Valley, but I guess the hope is to expand it? Um, it's actually offered just in Montgomery and Floyd County. And we're hoping to expand it and really go out there to any groups, homes, uh, new mom classes, anything like that, that we can come in there and just help those parents feel more assured about taking that baby home. Because I know at least knowing what to do, you have some peace of mind. Yes. Because it can be a scary situation. It can be. And that way, when you know, the unthinkable happens, uh, the remaining calm and knowing that you can take these CPR classes and have lots of practice time and get certification really helps out. And we had a, a Virginia Tech intern that designed this program for baby showers. So we could do this for a baby shower wow. and then the parents and their guests can t get a certificate to sign up for an American Red Cross course and get 10% off. Oh, okay. Yeah. So a lot of good information. Well, if you'd like more information about the Red Cross Safe Baby Program, you can call the number on your screen. That's 540-443-3606. You can also find a link to the, their website on our webpage at WDBJ7.com.